So oftentimes people ask us, what do we think about Alekna? He's one of the best, if not the best ever. Uh, I would argue he's probably accolades, distance, medals won, probably the best discus thrower of all time. So what do we think about his technique, right? I think it's important to know. This throw specifically I really like a lot. So let's go back. Now that we've acknowledged he's a very good thrower, I'm not judging his personality. I'm not judging his coach either. So um, well, I'm judging them in very high regard. So let's look at what he's done. Now, I'll also keep in mind, I don't know the background of his training. I don't know if he's ever been hurt. I don't know if there's positions he can't hit or hit because of injury. So I'd appreciate uh, that being acknowledged as well while doing this. So let's check it out. Good right leg out of the back. I love that long, long, long right leg. Long right leg. Dorsey flex, knee up, right? Love the left arm. Love the right side. This position is eerily similar to Dakers uh, right here. And what's even further uh, similar is that Alekna over-rotates just slightly, like where it's just past the center of sector, if you see that. Um, and I think one thing that I would try to teach my throwers, but probably not Alekna, is like come around that right, that left a little more, come around the left a little more aggressively, and that could prevent that over-rotation. I've never been a fan of his left arm. I've never liked this, but, it, it, you know, that's him. That's his technique, and it's repeatable. I've always loved his left leg here, and that low left has been, you know, that's this is why I t coach uh, Sam and all my throwers, although Alex does not do this, to have that lower left leg. I, I like that this angle or just a slight bit higher, but not above the knee for most throwers. Um, I'd say this is probably when he gra grounds his left Discus is very deep. Left shoulder always is a little forward on him, but he's very mobile in his thoracic spine, so it helps him still be patient. Um, and then you can see, uh, I like to tell people, hey, get to a flat left. And they're always like, well, nobody gets to a flat left. How are you going to do that? And then we forget that this is what Stahl and Alekna do so well. They get to that flat left. And, you can, and if you can pay attention to his left while his right rotates. See how his right side rotates and then he gets into that left forward. So he's still grounded on that left side, discus is out. A huge fan of that left arm, but that's him. I, I Like a lot of people can do that and it's okay. Um, but you can see where he reverses, his weight transfers forward very, in a, very well in a nice balanced position. I love this throw. I think it's one of the best ever. He's thrown, I think he's thrown the furthest in a stadium of, in, ever. Uh, he's got so many medals. He's one of the greatest ever. I'd, going back, I'd try to fix this sort of fall in with that left side to get a little more around the left to get that right down earlier, and I don't like his left arm. That's literally it. Otherwise, he's the best ever. If you want more information or you like technical analysis, head over to throwsuniversity.com and pick one up today. Peace.